and welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for another Meme Tier Monday special. We have Legacy of Sorrows. This is an infinite scribe of sorrows deck. So our deck has only three units. They are the three scribe of sorrows, nothing else. And we're going to be trying to Iceborne Legacy the scribe of sorrows to grant them plus two plus two. So the reason why we're going with Scribe of Sorrows is because Scribe says, when I'm summoned, create a copy in hand of an ally that died this game. So we need to, so this is a this is a difficult combo to pull off, but we need to find a Scribe of Sorrows, which there's only three in the deck, and then we need it to die. And then after it dies, then we need to play another Scribe of Sorrows or Mist Call to revive it, either one. Um, and then once we bring it back, then whenever it's summoned, then we have a Scribe of Sorrows die. So we'll create a new Scribe of Sorrows in our hand. And then from there, we got infinite Scribe of Sorrows. Each one that we play just creates another one, and we can just keep on going infinitely from there. So that's the hard part, is we need, we need one Scribe of Sorrows to start, and then we need it to die. And then we also need a second Scribe or a Mist Call to bring it back whenever it dies. <laughs> So super hard combo to, to get going. But once we get going, it's going to be pretty sweet. We'll just have infinite uh, Scribe of Sorrows. And um, then we'll Iceborne Legacy. And then they'll get plus two, plus two. So then there'll be four fives. And so we'll just have infinite four fives. Um, and then eventually we'll pack Mentality to kill our opponent. Um, so the... Uh, <laughs> the... The deck needs to be really defensive because we need to stay alive long enough to be able to find those. So we're going to have um, Avalanche, three Avalanche, three The Box, three Withering Whale, um, three Grass the Undying, three Vengeance, three Ruination, lots and lots of removal. Just try to try to stay alive. Then we'll have Harsh Winds, Flash Freeze, Brittle Steel, all of that to try to stay alive as well. Um, that's basically the whole deck is just all removal and then and then. Um, our combo with pack mentality to give them all plus two plus two and overwhelm to win uh, the game Then we have two two important one mana spells here absorb soul is a way for us to kill our scribe of sorrows Because like we said we scribe of sorrows has to be has to die so absorb soul can do that plus that four life is Going to help us uh, stay alive so important key there and then we also have elixir of iron to be able to protect just a little bit to help Iceborne Legacy resolve. Because this is a slow sp speed spell, um, if we're casting Iceborne Legacy on our Scribe of Sorrows and it only has the three health and they use, you know, get excited or whatever, or something like that to kill the Scribe of Sorrows in response, we'll help protect it a little bit with some Elixir of Irons. All right, so this is what Meme Tier Monday is all about. We got a crazy combo here. We're gonna go play over in normal. We're gonna go play five games, see if we can ever pull this combo off so um uh tizzle we don't really necessarily need it out of the first eight cards like you know like we're not our deck's really defensive right like we can um yeah you know, we can have like the box and all of those things you know avalanche you know like we can try to stay alive for a little bit longer and wait for it you know it doesn't have to be immediate even though we want it to be so we so you need to hard mulligan to look for Scribe of Sorrows. The only card that you can keep that's not Scribe of Sorrows is maybe a Miss Call. And decide to, you know, we got to keep a Miss Call too. Because we need it. not only a Scribe, but then we also need the Miss Call to go along with it also. Alright, so good news is that Omen Hawks are easy to kill. Bad news is they're going to make some other units that are going to be a lot more difficult to kill. Um... I don't think I Withering Whale right now. I think we just take this and, uh, you know, because Withering Whale will do enough damage. Uh, let's see, let's Avalanche. Because I guess to do five damage, I need to pair Avalanche with Grasp the Undying. Would be a good winter. 
Alright, Scrabosaurus, where are you at? Blessed by snow and stars. Looks of iron's good. One mana counter my five mana card. Starlets here are super annoying. Things are just way too big. Like how? <laughs> oh man, Starlet Seer and Omen Hawk. They're pretty great cards. This would be great to have Ruination right now. Unfortunately, we don't. But I wish we did. Just have to kill Starless here. Cards too good it's while these are larger starless here represents a lot more you know just it represents a lot more power and health combined over other things as well then so it's a bummer but just what we have to do ruination where are you That's the thing about the combo deck is there there are gonna be games where we just whiff and no Scrabosaro show up. It's gonna happen. So not the most exciting game. Great hand for the opponent. Sorrows. Is this the exact same hand we just mulliganed? Looks like it. That could be just somebody joining normal and conceding and just getting the XP for the day. That's what that kind of looked like, like somebody who didn't have much time to play, but just was joining normal games and conceding. <laughs> no, I'm not going to count that as a win. <sighs> Man, we're really bad at drawing Scribosaurus. Scribe of Sorrows. Can we get card draw in this deck? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Scrap of Sorrows. We did it. Now we need another Scrap of Sorrows or a Mist Call. And so that's why I don't really want to play it immediately and have it die, and then we draw Mist Call later.
Hmm. Here comes the punchline. Well, can't kill that. All right, there we go. There's a missed call. Oh, I have nine mana. I thought, yeah, I guess six plus three is nine. I was thinking I had ten mana and I could do that plus scribe plus miss call, but no, I can't. Good news is now we're going to be able to brittle steal this Vi later on. That's some good news. Now, how are we going to resolve Iceborne Legacy? That's the question. That's the main question. All right, so here's our combo. So now each time we play a scribe, we get a new one. <laughs> so we got infinite scribe of sorrows. Now <laughs> we don't need to draw another one. All right, so now we got our we got our combo going. Now I just I want to resolve Iceborne Legacy, but that's going to be it's easier said than done. Sure. Whatever. Oh, I didn't play the one they knew about. They knew about this one. I should have played the one they knew about. Yeah, I didn't I didn't play the correct one. They may be trying to get their... Yeah, they're going to be trying to get their Vi to level up. Okay, okay. Um, sure. So I am... Out of card space. And. Alright, so. Oh, well, Miss Call will just replace itself too. So our top card is just gonna get burnt. Hopefully it's nothing good. Alright, cool, that's fine.
Oh, just dealt two damage. That was two Ledros. Two Ledros and an Elise. I like to see that. I don't know if we can legacy. I mean, again, they can, like, they play gotcha and get excited, and so they could just have gotcha or get excited. That's how we do it. So I am worried about that. I I don't know like when when a better turn would be. I mean, basically, the better turn would be when we draw elixir of iron. Or like that's we want to draw this elixir of iron to help protect against gotcha and get excited. Ooh, okay, this could be the turn. This could be the turn. I, I didn't frostbite because I. I kind of want my things to die, <laughs> you know, right? Like, I have too much space. I didn't really care that thing was dying. Um... I want them under Vengeance mana before I play this Elixir of Iron. Or before I play the Iceborne Legacy. So like now, like this turn, so this turn I'm going to Iceborne Legacy. So I want them under Vengeance. All right, so I I need to cast harsh. Or okay, so I can cast flat, flash freeze, brittle steel. That's four mana. This is five, so that's nine, ten, eleven, twelve. All right, so I can do all of that with elixir of iron backup. Okay, cool. All right, we're good. Put me down to four. Could definitely just be burn spells that, that just kill me now. Would have been safer to play the Harsh Winds. But I want to turn these things into four fives. Swear slow. Okay. I thought about just passing. Basically, do they have burn spells to kill me or not? 
Mystic shot, not a good. Not a good sign. Not a good sign. So basically, I don't want this Gravisaros to die. Then we play two more. And then we can go straight to combat. Uh, I guess we... I guess we can't go straight to combat. Let's see. I mean, I guess if I do, we lose to Vengeance. If I don't... We can play around Vengeance. Okay, well, wouldn't have mattered. So I don't know if I don't know if I could have gotten the the Iceborne Legacy out earlier. Basically, I I could have harsh winds and then not played the Iceborne Legacy. I could have saved you know saved that eight life by harsh winding. Like that's so I could have done. But I don't know even like you know they Ledros. You know if they have that if I have that extra eight life and I'm at ten, they could still Ledros me, um, put me down to five and then Mystic Shot afterwards and things like that. Okay, double Scribe of Sorrow. I'm gonna keep the harsh ones. We got double Scribe of Sorrow. Let's go. Yeah, and then hopefully, yep, exactly. Hopefully the last one's at the bottom. We don't want to draw another one now. Don't need to draw them anymore now. Now we want, we want Legacy of Sorrows now. Or <laughs> Iceborne Legacy, sorry, that's the name of our deck. We want Iceborne Legacy now. Nothing gets between me and my mark. Hot damn is the boss. You best start running. So I'm going Avalanche because then at least Quinn will have two health, and so then these will be two ones, but they'll be able to block Quinn. So the other thing will be a 3 4. And the Withering Whale would have done a, a good job anyway. Yeah, our deck does really well with Ruination, right? Like, they, they keep playing stuff, and then we just Ruination, because, you know, we'll just keep, you know, we get to keep playing stuff out here. They play stuff. This is such a cool combo. <laughs> we just do this all day. Yeah, seems like a good time to ruination. That seems pretty scary. Huh? 
<laughs> GG's. Because, yeah, that's, that's perfect. So that's, that's exactly what we want our deck to do. That was awesome. So, yeah, you just... Like, how are they supposed to beat that? You just keep on playing 2-3s infinitely. You never lose them. And then what are they going to do? Kill your 2-3s? You're like, all right, that's fine. I get some more. And then once they have a larger a larger board, then you just ruination. I mean, they're running out of cards, but you're not. <laughs> all right, Mulligan. Scribe of Sorrows. Not quite. That's pretty sweet. <laughs> uh, what do we have? Swear slow. Um, swear slow. How does Thursday sound for you? Thursday, okay? Does death follow me or peace? I have more meme tier decks for tomorrow. And then I am playing... Um, and then I have another deep donation deck for Wednesday. And so yours is a deep donation deck, so how about Thursday? Okay. Thursday's an, you know going to be an early stream again. Um, do you have... Sure. Do you have a preference for a second, third, or fourth? Death comes. It'll be like the same time as this stream now. So if you want it like around this time on Thursday, we can do third. Alright, Scrabasaro, where are you? Definitely seems like a hacker or a harrowing deck. We need to save Ruination for harrowing. Did it move? Everyone's a garden. <laughs> I'll still have Vengeance Mana next turn. Glimpse Beyond's a killer. It's two Glimpse Beyonds. We really don't want to see Rekindler, right? But, like, they're drawn into their deck. How do you get your card? Why can't I find my Scrap of Sorrows? Scribe of Sorrows. I was like, they definitely have Hecarim and... Ooh, no Rekindler. There's Ice Born Legacy. Sure. Not, I am not playing much. Two denies already gone. That's good news. You know, I'd much rather have those things get denied than like ruination get denied. Huh. Scribe of Sorrows? No. Just need a Scribe of Sorrows.
Kind of clearing a spot out of my hand, using some mana. It's fine. We got some other stuff. This one one card gains, you know, gain seven life. I think that's okay. Ooh, there you go, Big Alfredo. That's an interesting one. Yeah, we could play Ruination. That is 12 mana Scribe of Sorrows. Or sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, War Mother's Call. Yeah, I mean, I'd like to have a War Mother's Call right here, right? 12 mana Scribe of Sorrows. That sounds pretty good. Mm. Correct, same law. There's no card draw in the deck. And we have to just... I mean, we have we have mulliganing. Right, like we mulligan. Well, now I'm kind of running out of removal and everything, too. Come on, Scribe of Sorrows. Scribe, 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 Scribe. Come on, Scribe. Hmm. No. Come on, scribe. Nope. Oh, fresh soil. Not great. Come on, scribe. There we go. We're halfway there. All right. We, we get to start now. Everyone's a garden. We get to start. O threes, that's fine. Go ahead, you have a bunch of O threes. I don't care. Do whatever you want. Yeah, I guess maybe. Yeah, I guess I could use Brill Steel. Save absorb so we'll get the mist. Yeah, I guess I guess we have to miss call this turn. Never mind. Okay. Let's go. Infinite scribe of sorrows. Can't block Callista yet. Callista's too fearsome. We burn, then kindle anew. 
Okay, this won't be easy. No, I don't think it was the box. I think the, this is probably getting another blocker was better. Because um, we could the box here. Oh, it was turn. Let's see. 19 minus 4 is what, 15? Turn 15 is whenever we started playing units. So you're telling me that that's, that's too late? Turn 15? Probably too late. Little scribe of sorrows. The little scribes that could. It's real awkward with this thing costing five mana of us not being able to play two scribes in a legacy in one turn. Alright, try to gain four life. They're all about these ruinations. So I really want to draw ruination because I think that they're setting up harrowing for their turn. And so I need to draw ruination here. Oh, that's so close. I thought that was ruination could just from the art. But it was not.
<laughs> a little Scravisaur, who could? Okay, they didn't. All right, so yeah, it looks like we need to do stuff before turn 15. Okay, it's turn 15 whenever we first, whenever we played our first unit. We did last a long time for not doing anything. We did last a long time. Well, at least their Ezreal won't level up. <laughs> we don't play a unit until turn 15. They won't level up their Ezreal. Gosh. Come on, deck. Yeah, possibly if we could have had that the scribe like five turns sooner and had it like turn ten, maybe we wouldn't have had to use like so much removal for nothing. If they just nabbed my scribe of sorrows. I'm gonna be mad. I thought you'd never ask. Um The Boxer Grasp. Chat saying box. Box harder to use. But Box has a lot higher upside, right? Like, they play um, the 3 mana 3-2 three, that brings in another unit. We can use the Box to clean them both up. I do have Avalanche for that, though, also. So, with us having Avalanche, I'll just use the Box. Scribe. Alright, well, pretty good use of the Box. We got another one. Hopefully they draw all my Frostbite cards that we don't care about anyway. What if they just have triple Scrabble's Arrows? Absorb Soul. That's honestly a good one to have. I wish, you know, like, I wouldn't mind having that later. Because we need to draw two Scribus Arrows. We need to have one and a Miss Call. Or two. This deck's pretty rough. <laughs> this is two games in a row of us. Just. I mean, three out of the five games of us just not even having a chance. We just don't have anything to do. Goes an Iceborne Legacy. So I can Vengeance this thing, but then they still have a 2 1. Or I just let it resolve and then Ruination. It's not like they go white anyway. I can, I can use Vengeance. On other things. But I like getting both black market merchants out of here. Uh, 
Well, that's not good. Well, there's there goes one of my six cards I need. Yeah, it's from the bottom. I know, I know. Wouldn't, wouldn't draw that card anyway. It's just we we have more information about cards that we could draw, so we know that you know like that's what it that's what it is. It's not like I wasn't. I'm not. I'm not s sad to like say, oh man, we can't draw that, but it's it's information about what what we know is left in the deck. I have to kill that 3-2. Yeah, Nenyal, you never struggle this much to get the Avalanche combo going? Yeah, must be lucky. Or the, the Scribe combo going. Must be lucky. Alright, so we're still two draw steps away. It only feels like we have to play other units besides Scrabosaros. Like this just isn't isn't realistic with only playing Scrabosaros. At least they're not going to ever level up Ezreal. And they'll never level up Twisted Fate. But yeah, half, another halfway through the deck and... Didn't see anything at all. Good job, Digimon. You just made it to Masters. Good job. Yeah, way to go. Very nice. Alright, so that's the Legacy of Sorrows. We did win a game. We did win a game. That was good. Um, that was a, a perfect game of us having two Scribe of Sorrows in our opener and then a Ruination against a Demacia deck. That was a perfect game. Um, but yeah, it's pretty tough. There are six cards. You have to have a Scribe of Sorrows, one, and then two, you have to have either another Scribe of Sorrows or a Mist Call. And as we saw there with those games, that was basically, uh, that was really super hard to do in, in what, three of the four or, or four, or all four of our losses? I don't know. Um, so yeah, I mean, that, that's definitely what Mean Tier is all about. Needed to live the dream. We did have that one game where we lived the dream with the the scribe of sorrows and that was really cool our opponent just conceded they couldn't handle the weight of infinite two threes all right those of y'all watching later on youtube hit that like button over there feel free to leave those comments too if you pull off the combo get anything cool with it let me know over there in the comment section but thank you so much for watching and i'll see you for the next video